What is levothyroxine and why did your doctor prescribe it? If you received a prescription for levothyroxine, you most likely have a condition called hypothyroidism. But what is hypothyroidism? The thyroid gland is located in your neck, right above your windpipe. It is responsible for the release of thyroid hormones known as T3 and T4. The thyroid is signaled to release T3 and T4 by the brain, specifically by a hormone called thyroid-stimulating hormone released from the pituitary gland. Thyroid-stimulating hormone is referred to as TSH. In hypothyroidism, the T4 hormone is low and the TSH hormone is high. That's because TSH is trying to signal the thyroid to release thyroid hormone, but the thyroid can't release any hormones, hence the TSH builds up. And when blood work is performed, it will show both the decrease in T4 and the increase in TSH and a diagnosis of hypothyroidism is made. The most common cause of hypothyroidism is something called Hashimoto's disease. This is a condition where your own immune system attacks your thyroid gland and destroys it, leaving it unable to release any thyroid hormones. Some drugs can also cause hypothyroidism, including carbamazepine, used in patients with seizures and amiodarone, used in patients with atrial fibrillation. So what's the role of the thyroid hormones? Well, thyroid hormones help regulate metabolism. This includes the nervous and cardiac system, body temperature, muscle strength, skin dryness, weight, and cholesterol levels. When the hormone levels are out of whack, we tend to see the symptoms of hypothyroidism, such as weight gain, fatigue, hair loss, cold intolerance, and goiter to name a few. However, some patients have no symptoms. Weight gain is the most troublesome complaint we see in patients with hypothyroidism, and that's why there is a black box warning for the use of this medication as a weight loss drug. Most people tend to assume that if low thyroid hormone levels cause weight gain, that must mean that increasing them with this medication will cause weight loss. Well, the answer to that is no, not only is this not effective, but it is also lethally toxic. So please do not take more than you are prescribed in order to lose weight. Now let's talk about how the drug works. Levothyroxine is a synthetic form of the natural thyroid hormone T4, which is found in the body. When you take it, it works in the same way as natural T4 to regulate metabolism and prevent all of those troublesome symptoms. However, levothyroxine does come with its side effects. Side effects you need to look out for when you are taking this medication are signs that the dose is too high. And these are essentially symptoms of hyperthyroidism, a condition in which there is too much T4 being released, or in this case, ingested. They include an increased heart rate, palpitations, sweating, weight loss, arrhythmias, and irritability. If you experience any of these, make sure to inform your doctor right away. But don't worry, in order to avoid this, your doctor will conduct blood work every four to six weeks to make sure the levels of thyroid hormone in your body are correct. Once you have the right dose, then you'll most likely get blood work done every 6 to 12 months. When you take this medication, it is important to take it with a full glass of water at the same time each day. You also need to take it at least 30 minutes before breakfast, or you can take it at bedtime at least 3 hours after your last meal. This is done to ensure consistent absorption of the drug. One thing you need to note is that you also need to pay attention when picking up your prescription. Unlike most of the other drugs, when you're picking up this medication, you need to make sure that it is the same manufacturer and the same preparation each time. Different manufacturers can lead to variability in the effect of the drug with each refill, meaning it may not work the same with a different manufacturer. The colors of the tablets also matter, and each strength has a different color. So if you notice that your levothyroxine is not the usual color, make sure to speak with your pharmacist to confirm if a dosage adjustment has been made. Hypothyroidism can lead to a dangerous complication called mixed edema coma. It is an uncommon complication, but a life-threatening one that can be fatal. It occurs when hypothyroidism is left untreated for a long period of time, and it is a medical emergency. It is characterized by poor blood circulation, hypothermia, and hypometabolism. And it is treated in the emergency room with IV levothyroxine. If you experience any of these symptoms, make sure to seek medical assistance immediately. Some drugs can interact with this medication and affect the way it works. This includes antacids, iron, calcium, magnesium, multivitamins, orlistat, and aluminum to name a few. 
all of these drugs can bind to levothyroxine and decrease its effects. So if you are ever interested in purchasing anything over the counter, make sure to consult your pharmacist. Let's wrap up everything we've learned. Levothyroxine is a synthetic version of a natural hormone produced in your body called T4, and T4 is a hormone that maintains metabolism. This medication should never be used for weight loss, and doing so can be toxic. When taking it, make sure to take it with water either before breakfast or at bedtime three hours after your last meal. If you notice any changes in your prescription, such as the color of the tablet or manufacturer, make sure to consult your pharmacist. And keep an eye out for signs of hyperthyroidism, which indicate your dose is too high. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please consider leaving a like and subscribing for more videos on medication counseling. Thank you.